New at noon, the search is on for the gunman who fired a shot that wounded a 72 year old woman inside of her home. It happened on 128th Street in South Ozone Park at around 1130 last night. Police say the victim was sitting in a chair when a stray bullet came through her living room window and hit her in the hand. The victim was treated for the gunshot wound at Jamaica Medical Center. She's expected to be OK. Authorities say a black sedan was seen fleeing the scene. New at noon, a TSA officer at Newark Airport stopped a passenger who had stuffed a loaded handgun gun into his carry on luggage. TSA officials then alerted Port Authority police who confiscated the handgun, arrested the man from Ocean County, New Jersey. Now, this happened last Friday. The passenger claimed he forgot he had placed the firearm into his carry on bag. The passenger now faces a federal weapons charge. It was the ninth gun discovered by agents at the airport so far this year. Meanwhile, at LaGuardia Airport, TSA agents spotted a man carrying a tactical knife in his carry on luggage. This was on Memorial Day yesterday. The weapon described as a tactical fighting knife with 10 inch blade. Police issued the passenger a summons and confiscated the knife. And if all that wasn't enough, at Westchester County Airport, TSA discovered a passenger with seven boxes of ammunition in a traveler's carry on bag yesterday. In all, officials say he was carrying 320 bullets. The TSA official reminds the traveling public ammunition and firearms are not allowed in carry on bags. However, they can be packed in checked luggage.